starting in 2007, I helped send uh, movies dubbed into Spanish and, and books into Cuba for the underground library movement there. You know, they were stuck, they continue to be stuck in this kind of uh, communist police state, but they are able to use technology to get outside, in, at least in their minds. Um, and that led, led, led us later to work on North Korea as well, where we've been like sending uh, USB sticks filled with outside information into North Korea over the last uh, decade. We've sent about 100,000 USB sticks and SD cards in. So our politicians out here are dithering and useless and basically supporting the North Korean government in different ways for different reasons. You know, the Chinese, the Americans, the, the South Koreans, like no one really wants to see the regime fall. So, so they kind of just... Um, keep the status quo, which means that these gulags and horrible conditions for these people just persist. So we could do something, you know, we, we can act, we can, we can help individuals. So we've been peacefully sending in information and technology. And we think that that's very important. We also do a lot of digital security training for activists to help them understand how to use things like signal or VPNs. Um, we, we've been doing that since 2013 and I would say that the activist movement, generally speaking, that we interact with has 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 figured it out.